I strongly advise you to uh, look through the paper and understand both the linked list version as well as the previous Anderson's array-based uh, lock version of the queuing locks uh, because lots of subtleties in implementing these kinds of algorithms in the kernel, uh, in, in the parallel operating system kernel. And therefore, it is important that you understand these subtleties by looking at the code. I've given you, of course, a description at a semantic level of what happens, but looking at the code will actually make it very clear what is going on in terms of writing a synchronization algorithm on a multiprocessor. And one of the things that I mentioned is that both the um, the linked list based queuing lock as well as the earlier array based queuing lock required fancier read modified write instruction. So for instance, in this case, we need a fetch and store, and in this case, uh, and also a compare and swap two fancier read modified write instru instructions. And similarly, the array based queuing lock required a, a fetch and increment. Now it is possible that the architecture doesn't have that. If that is the case, then you have to simulate these fancier uh, read modify write instructions using the simpler test and set instruction.